They told me about you, but they didn't mention your beauty. What? No, sir, they did not. <gasps> oh, you're mine now, love. No, sir. Forever. And ever. Hell no. And ever. Get away from me. No more speechifying. Get him. Yeah, his men don't like him talking like that either. That is weird. I am the stone that the builder refused. I am the visual, the inspiration that made ladies see the blues. I'm the spark that makes your idea bright. The same spark that lights the dark so that you can hold your nothing. I am the ballad in your box, the bullet in the gun, the in the glow that let you know to call your brother son. The story that we've begun, the promise of what's to come, and I will remain a soldier to the war. Welcome back to the channel, everybody. This is episode two of the series. And let me just give you a little update on what happened if you are not sure or you are confused. So, in episode one of our rerun, I was killed. This is common knowledge. Okay, so I died. Now, let me just go over what happened. After I died, I came back into the game and thank God I did not have to go back and get all my shit back. Thank God that did not happen, okay? So I did not have to go back and find all of these things. That saved me a hell of a lot of time. So what I spent my time doing was I went around and continuously killed the shit out of a bunch of captains. Um, it doesn't look like I killed that many right now, but I'm telling you I did kill a lot. They just like regenerate over time. So I killed this war chief and um, I was actually going to go kill another one, but then I just put my controller down and I just went to go eat. So now I am back recording again, and there is a FedEx van outside my house. It doesn't matter. Um, so yeah, I killed a bunch of captains, and I got all of my capacity skills back. It took away all of my skill points. So I got all these back, and then I filled in these two, and I have two left over. So that was kind of good. I'm kind of glad we died, actually, to be honest. Because now I can like focus some more on the stuff that I was doing. Um, so these are the new skills that we have. I'm going to read them to you real quick, the ones that actually matter. This one, chain kills explode enemies' heads inciting terror. And then stealth attacks light enemies on fire. That's pretty much it. And as you can see, we have a shit ton of coin. So, again, not everything that came out of it was bad. So I'm going to go ahead and buy some mercenaries real quick. Go into the army screen. Hire mercenaries. Let's see who we can get, or not even who we can get, who we will get. Aaron the Warrior. He's a guardian. Okay, first of all, let's look for combat masters. No, you're not getting branded because you can be terrified by more guy flies. Uh, actually, I'll come back to him. Killick the Unfortunate. Yeah, every time I hire someone called the unfortunate they don't they always die what is this take 50 percent less damage from enraged enemy okay so what is he a quartermaster what is his quartermaster ability fire bolt supplier okay so what i learned is i don't really need quartermasters honestly they don't really do that much for me since i don't really need fire bolts especially when i can just pick them up from those bodies so what I'm looking for mainly is combat masters and this dude has seven class traits. He's immune to curse, good to know. He's power crazed, good to know. That is that is actually very good. Because what that does is people around him that are um, higher levels. So he's a level 33. Say I come across like a level 40 or 50 or 60 something, he's going to get enraged, which is always good, especially since he's an archer. Fear of Grogs is bad. I don't know how I feel about that. And then um, he's got Inspires Archers, which isn't really that great. And then what is this? Epic Trait Rage Stomper. He does more damage against enraged enemies. Okay, so that's pretty damn good. Smoke Screen, good. Terrified, that's alright. Firebomb Volley, Knife Thrower, Agile, and Smoke Bomb. Those are good. Okay, so if I had to pick one right now, it would be Shoddy the Dancer. 
The last one I have to look at is this dude. Ulu the Unlucky. Damaged by beasts. Apparently that's the only weakness he has. Fighting fit. Takes less damage when his health is greater than 75%. Okay, so this man is not dying. And finishing frenzy. Inflicts greater damage when health is greater than 75%. That's good to have. So this man is broken. He's got thick skin too. Wave of might, taunt, and heroic war cry. Okay, so this dude is broken. So we're gonna grab these two right here. Shoddy the dancer, you're with me. Okay. And we're gonna go ahead and grab um, Ulu the unlucky. I don't even know why his name would be the unlucky. This man is like indestructible. All right, I will put you off to the right. You will be my right, my right hand man, and you will be my left hand. <laughs> now we just need a middle hand. That was a bad joke. I'm sorry. If you didn't understand it, it was a bad dick joke. Okay. So I feel like we can take out one of these um, outposts. I just don't feel like doing that right now because we don't have that much money. So instead of doing that, let's go ahead and do the next story mission. All right, the raid. Join Circa and his mercenaries as they raid an orc caravan. I don't even know why I read that. I'm going to skip it anyway. But if you don't already know this, like I said earlier on... I'm skipping all the cutscenes because we already saw them. If you didn't, go ahead back to the first playthrough and you will see all the cutscenes there. But here on our second playthrough, we're skipping them. Alright. My two hands will protect me. Not that I need protecting. He said dance, demon, da Okay, wait, though. Let me see your smoke screen. Okay, so apparently you can hide in the smoke screen. And they can't see you. Okay, so what is your ability? Do it. Okay, so his ability is... He gives up his health and heals people near him. So it's a give and take. I don't know how I feel about that. I don't want him loosening up his health to heal other people, but... I guess at some point it becomes beneficial. Let me go back this way. The rest of the caravans are over here. Grab this. Olog's run slow as hell. All the supplies come through this canyon. Let me grab that. Done. This is all Gondorian ah, coin. Ah shit, okay, I and can't now, skip this. It's Easterling coin. Let's get these wagons back to the oasis. Today, we get paid. These caravans have to stop. You and your boys need to get all this grog cleaned up before any wereworms show up. And don't spill any more, or you'll bring the rumbler here. This is gonna take forever. Okay, let's go ahead and start, because the last time we did this, our guys kept going down continuously. Or at that point, we only had one guy, so our guy kept going down continuously, but still, I didn't forget. And these wereworms keep trying to kill me the entire time. Why didn't I think to do that first? Wait, can I do the shield, sh uh, die please? Can I do the shield strike and get these all in one hit? Oh shit, okay, that bad idea. Bad idea, that was a horrible idea. Do not try to do that again. I don't know why I thought about that. Yeah, let me just hit these grog, oh god. Let me just hit these grog barrels with a flaming shield. Yeah, I'm smart. That's a loud ass rumble on my controller right now. It is still non-stop vibrating. There we go, okay, let's get the hell out of here. I'm not trying to get killed by a big ass worm. Running, 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 running. Skip. Big ass worm. Okay.
Skill unlocked. Rally. Cool. Now I just need a plan. Alright, where is the... I believe the next story mission is over at the Fortress, right? Where we sneak in? Yes, it is. Okay, so let's go ahead and get over there. There is a cutscene. It is getting skipped. This doesn't technically count as a cutscene. Okay. If you're serious about taking this fort and <laughs> getting me my coin, we'll need to find out what we're up against. And we'll need to be discreet. I wouldn't want to ruin your reputation on the orcs. Baranor is not really known for being discreet. He's known for being an idiot. What is this? We'll look at that in a minute. Is he still vulnerable to execution? Probably. I feel like the DLC purposely makes whoever this is always vulnerable to execution. It's always the same person too. Okay. Idiot. No need to trouble yourself. Let me grab this. Anything useful? Probably not. Okay. I'm gonna go into my inventory real quick just to see what we picked up. It was this right here. 30% increased critical hit damage from melee attacks while you're- No. Get, the, get rid of that shit. We'll attack- or what? Attack? What? We'll attach this though. And we can do this. Okay. We're gonna spend the rest of our skill points on rally. And let's read whatever the hell this is. His overlord chose his war chiefs well. He's called Takra, the sand spider. Encourages competition within his ranks. A bloody business, but does weed out food. Okay, so the goal is to pick up intel without alerting the overlords. Oh, they're not much different from mercenaries. They like to think, to sing, and to kill. I smell something! No, you don't. Shut up. Be quiet. I'm equipping steel bolts for whenever I have to do stealth attacks because I'd rather not shoot them with bombs. That might be a little loud. I don't even know why I activated my parachute. You lived a hard life, Jagai. But I survived, didn't I? I lived long enough to meet you again. That's better than most. Alright, let's start from all the way back here and work our way back up. I don't know whatever the hell he was about to say, but he started a sentence and I shot him in the head. How have you survived among the Easterlings? By letting Jagai die. By becoming Serka. She was weak. He could be heard killed. Serka cannot. I love this crossbow. I love the crossbow more than I like Talion's bow. Where's the last one? It's right here. Okay. <gasps> Shit. I gotta stop pulling my parachute when I'm touching the ground. It's we're, weird. We're almost done. But I'm not leaving here empty handed. I think I saw some gold back there. Finish up so we can leave. Okay, so unlike last time, I didn't get hit this time. Because I'm not trash. Like I was last time. You talk too much. And now it is time to leave. Maybe a good time to leave. Okay, it's a different captain this time. It's unstoppable. Wow, flammable. And I can stealth attack him. When I can literally do both of those at the same time, it is not your lucky day. Goodbye. This probably won't kill him though. But it will set his ass on fire. How that didn't kill you, I have no idea. Goodbye. See, I love the fact that it's a fully charged shot when you don't even have to aim. That is so much more convenient. Goodbye, Circa. I'm leaving. 
I said circa. Goodbye, Jagai. I'm not finna wait here and get killed just because you don't have a, a parachute. I can't skip this one either. Now we know what we're dealing with. I've seen two kinds of mercenary, brother. One of them fights for gold, and the other seeks death in whatever way he can find it. I'm starting to think you're the second kind. Well, what if I am? All right, skill unlock, leadership intel, cool. The circus is now available. Before we do that, we do need to kill some more captains. So let's go ahead. Which overlord? Overlord, what? Okay, let's kill him. Just because of the way he looks. Because he looks like the tower. I haven't seen the tower in this game in like a solid eight months. It has been months since I've seen the tower. Not so much imposing as it is extra. I don't know. Maybe I'll see him again during the campaign walkthrough. Whatever it was, hold on. There we go. Unleashed the pretender. I don't know why, but the pretender orc is always scared of spiders, and he's a level 66. How does that happen? Thought they couldn't exceed level 65. Okay, I have to let go. Or what? Let go. Let his caragors out. So here's one, two. Get off the ground before they attack me. And that's just a cage. Okay, I need a caragor. Nope, that isn't just a cage. There's one in there. I know he's not going to show up until I stop flying around, so I'd rather get to a point that's advantageous to us first. This is good. Oh, I have to kill the Karagors! Never mind. One. I thought I just had to let them out. Okay, wait, so... Shit, where'd the other ones go? There's a captain over here, and there's another cage over here. Who is this? His name is Headstone, and he's arrowproof. Arrowproof does not make you bombproof, buddy. Or fireproof. What have you got to say for yourself? Nothing? Cool, okay. Let's hit him with concussions. Come on. Okay, now let's hit him with fire. See, if an orc is arrowproof in this DLC, technically you cannot shoot him with bolts because it won't do anything. I mean, actually, technically you can. It'll just only do the elemental damage, which is pretty much all I'm after. As long as the elemental... What? As long as the elemental damage is um, dished out, I'm set. Oh my god. I need y'all to chill out. Okay, so let's not die again. I would much rather that not happen twice. Where'd he go? He's down here. Wrong person. Okay, let's summon our guys. Hopefully they can help me out with this, because I'm definitely not going to die here. And there's another captain here. Alright, well... This just got more toxic. Firebolts. Okay, I would rather him stop healing. Holy shit. Okay, he's a hell of a lot more intimidating up close. Tear him apart. Okay, I can shoot him though, so he's pretty much dead already. Stop trying to heal yourself. Toxic motherfucker. Okay, and now the war chief is here. 
And he's got a bodyguard with him. Cute, but no. Switch to poison bolts. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Let me grab these and I can replace my- PLEASE DON'T HIT ME! Jesus! Asshole. Well, now I've got my bombs back. So you know what? You get to die. Come on, kill that captain over there. Thank you very much. Damn, y'all see all that poison? Stop healing. This man is like... Dead set on not dying. Thank you. Okay. We're good now. Sorry I set you guys on fire. I did not mean to do that. Okay. Let's go open our character menu. How many skill points do we have? One? Cool. Thought we would have more. But that's alright. Replaces steel bolts now that we use um, whatever the hell that move is called. More damage, give me that. More damage, give me that. More damage, give me that. What is this? 60% less damage taken from enraged enemies. Uh, uh, sure, yeah. Uh, mm hmm, nope. I was gonna do it, but I'm saving the spots, a majority, again, I'm saving a majority of the spots for legendary gear pieces. And I know I've got a lot of slots left, but I just don't want to waste them on stuff that might not even be entirely as useful as I originally thought it would be. Maggot Nest. As long as I can stealth attack him, he's pretty much dead. For example. Go up. And all things that go up must come down. My guys are already here. Nope. Okay, I thought he hit me with that. Because I'm pretty sure if I go down, I'm going to die. And I would much rather not. Switch to concussions. This man is still alive somehow. Switch to poisons. Dead. Can I get that humiliator sword thing back? That's what I loved about the last playthrough. I had the Humiliator Sword on Baranor. Alright, we need to fill our bombs back up. And there's a corpse down here. Baranor, I did not tell you to jump that far. Give me this and let's disappear. Come on, come on. Go up. Okay, let's get the drop on what's his name over here. We gotta kill- Oh, yes, he's legendary, okay. He's gonna drop legendary gear, good. Shit. I will reach inside you and fill you with darkness. Personally, I would much rather you not do that. I'm gonna heal so that I don't die. Let's come over here and kill his bodyguard first. Okay, I need y'all to get over here and help me out with this. I'm not trying to fight these guys by myself. Did not try to jump on that Olog. And I know what's his name is Sickly. Stop jumping. I, I need this Olog to get out of here so I can freely press A. Okay, fire bombs. I use these bombs a lot, guys. I, I rely on these bombs to win fights. Y'all are gonna see me using these all the time. Because these things are literally busted. And he's running. Where are you going? How far do you think you'll be able to get, huh? How far? What's his name's enraged? He's not letting you go. You're dead. 
That was very weirdly animated. But you know what? Whatever. We got a legendary orc. I'm happy. Let's get out of sight real quick. And let's see what we got from that. How many skill points? We got three. Okay. Okay, so gain intel on outpost leaders and gain intel on all war chiefs, the overlord, all captains who are not outpost leaders. Okay, so it's just regular captains. Okay, so I'm, I'm fine with that. I don't even care. I know everybody in the region now. I know everyone and their weaknesses. For instance, he is terrified of more guy flies. Would not have known that. He is terrified of burning. What else? This guy was terrified of stealth, but it didn't kick in for some reason when I stealth attacked him. So now I can pick my fights more wisely. There's the ringmaster that we just passed to the left. The diseased. Haven't seen this man in a while. Okay, so we're all set. Who are the other... Oh, okay, God. No. The Obsessed. This dude is a weirdo. We have an extra skill point, so I guess we should just keep pushing on with the story. Restore one poison bolt on a stealth attack. Nah. Recover all health and gain all might or full might after stealth killing a captain. Um, nah. I'm interested in what this legendary thing was though. Fanatical command. Allies become enraged when you take damage. Yes. You hit me, it's like you're hitting them. And I just got enough money to buy another mercenary. Okay. It's a quartermaster, a combat master, and a guardian. I already have a guardian and a combat master, so naturally I would pick the quartermaster. But he has a fear of burning, which is a problem. Because I set off firebombs literally all the time. So you know what? Let's not. I'm going to grab the guy who's afraid of more guy flies. Unless. Unless. Hold on. He's enraged by burning, which is good. Taunt, call the banners. He takes less damage from enraged enemies. He's got a Karagor pack, but he's a combat master. He goes straight for captains and he... I might gotta... Uh... Yep, we going for him. Alright, I gotta come up with names for him. You will be my down pad. This is my inner circle. Alright, so now, from now on, the rest of the money that we spend will all be spent towards um, buying outpost leaders. I'm still personally looking around for legendary orcs just so I can get some... Uh, oh, God, I thought that was a captain that ran up on me. Don't do that. Where are you going? And what is he enraged by? Why are they both enraged? Deadly speed, here we go. Oh, this is the stealth part. Okay. One. Two. I love the fact that their bodies get set on fire after I do it. Don't see me, don't see me. He saw me, he saw me. He was too slow though. Got him. Three. Okay, come on. Four. One more. Being able to float up in the air like that makes getting stealth attacks so much easier. Now I can just pounce on anybody and it'll be the fifth. Um, let's grab whoever this is. I didn't even see you. I just held right trigger eggs. 
so quick? How do you even enjoy it? I will show you how to properly stretch out a kill. I would rather you not, actually. All right, I got to stealth attack him. Come on, grapple up higher. Okay, I don't even know if I can hit him. Please tell me this is him. Yep, got him. Get that stealth. Okay, wow, well, that damage was garbage. Switching to fire bombs. They told me about you, but they didn't mention your beauty. What? No, sir, they did not. Oh, you're mine now, love. No, sir. Forever. And ever. Hell no. And ever. Get away from me. No more speechifying. Get him. Yeah, his men don't like him talking like that either. That is weird. What? But never mind. I'm here. You did not kill what's his name. No, he's still alive. What? Oh shit. Get in here. So now what? I got four captains here to fight? Y'all are gonna need more than that to kill me. <laughs> okay, maybe not. Did you see how furiously this man tried to hit me? I'm doing my part. Uh-huh. Come on, people. Come on. We got to kill the war chief, but I prefer to kill him last. Oh, this dude's retreating. No, 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 no. Aren't you the one that tried to hit me? And he's immune to that. Let's burn him, then. Got him. Good. That's what I hired you for, to kill captains. That is what I hired you for. Activate your abilities. I need this big-ass Olog to back up. Let me heal myself so I don't get killed. Alright, he burned to death. Good. Keep moving. Don't let him get a hit off on you. Why is this Olog so far away from the fight? Vigilant against stealth. Okay, we love to see it. He died immediately. I shot him once and he died immediately. Okay, there's four of us. Can we kill him, please? Oh, shit. Did not try to let him hit me. Okay, cut that out. Okay, guys, there's there's literally four of us here. Kill him. Both of you use your abilities. Got him. He's dead. Good. See, this dynamic I got right here, why are you attacking each other? This dynamic I got right here, with the shield dude, and then the two archers, unbeatable. It's an impervious defense. I don't want to hear it. And I'm pretty sure I can, I can hide in the smoke bomb too, right? It acts like I'm like hiding, hiding. I don't know, I just think that's a cool mechanic. Okay, so from that I got a thousand more coin. So, we have enough to hire somebody after we take one of those outposts. We have a good amount of skill points for when we unlock another skill. And we are gaining collectibles by the second. Alright, let's see, what is this? 40 per, nope, not even 40%. 40 health recovery per second while cursed. Okay, I would rather not be cursed. That is so specific, too. It's not even useful. What is this? Venom Edge. 30% chance enemies are poisoned when they hit you with a melee attack. That's also trash. The point is to not get hit. 
And if I am hit, like if it's something that says like I have to get hit, I would rather it be like more than a 30% chance to retaliate. 30% is kind of garbage. Alright, what's this one? Fire water. Trickster, the Regal. He is stealth proof, good to know, but he is poison proof as well. He's not fireproof. Possessive master, enraged by poison. So what, just burn him then? I can do that. Detonate grog stacks. As long as you can mark them, I can set them on fire. There goes one. Taking flight. I need to go refill my bombs before I start another fight. Shit. Those are concussion bombs down there. I need fire bombs. Okay, here we go. There's a body right here. Right? Oh yeah, it's right here. I'm an idiot. I cannot see. Give me that. Okay, we're full up. Let's go ahead and detonate that. Where you at, bitch? I did not know that he had a bodyguard. Yeah, you for being stupid. Summon, 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 summon. Come here, bitch. A little bit closer. Baronor, jump on him. Got him. I don't like the fact that I can be hit in the middle of that animation. He's terrified. Okay. What's up? I'm gonna give you a little something extra for all the trouble you've caused. Sure. Hold that thought. He got stabbed in the back. And now I'm entirely inside this man. Okay, hold up. Oh shit, did not mean to poison him. Well, now he's enraged. Uh, uh, concussion. You need a timeout. Firebomb. Concussion. He gets up, knock him back down. See, the, these three captains are literally bodying him, especially since the two archers are both combat masters, or whatever the hell that class is called. And especially since they're always enraged. I literally, once these two guys are around me, I cannot be killed. I'm invincible. I'm literally invincible around these three. My three horsemen. How many skill points do we have? Four? Alright, we need to do the next story mission so that we can not let these just sit here and go to waste. What is this? Freezing capsules. Shield bash. B. Freezes enemies. Give me that. I'll take that. And then this is just more focus. Okay, so let me go try this out before we get to the next story mission. Come here, bitch. I like that. So now I have a way of freezing enemies. That's good. All right, well, let's head over and do the circus mission. The circus. Not even going to read it. We already know what happens. We're skipping. Oh, Circa looks like he's in trouble. And this dude is still a weirdo. See, that's why I like Circa. He's not a bitch. Like, he's not even scared. He's ready to fight. Circa's ready to fight. He's, like, dead ass ready to throw down. Okay, I forgot that he was stealth proof. 
attraction in our festival of You would think I remember this as I recorded this yesterday. But uh no. Did not remember. So you get back, and I'm calling my banners. F he's enraged by stealth. Okay, well, you stay in that corner then, if you're gonna act like that. I'm keeping you in that corner. And there's a wereworm here. Get back. Look, he's got an arrow in his head, and he's still talking normally. He looks like someone threw up on him. Fire arrows, everybody get away from me. Get away, get back. One, two, three, four, five. Switch to poisons. Everybody get back, especially that damn Olog. You can die, and I don't have enough of those bolts to continue doing that. Oh, this Grog is going to try and kill me. Typical. I would rather you not. Wait, isn't one of my guys a Beast Slayer? Can't he just kill it? Shit, you would think so. Switch the bolts, and light everybody up. Light everybody up. Shit. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Damn. It's like one, two, three, dead, 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 dead. Look at the way they walk in. Like he the shit. Oh, you said bomb? Uh, you're lucky I'm out of bombs. You are so lucky I'm out of bombs. I was about to say, or bomb? <laughs> I got you. Everybody get back. You're dead. 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 Oh, more bolts? Dead. 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 Oh, God. Instant regret. Instant regret. I'm not dying again on recording. Stop it. Dead. Oh, Circa killed him. Circa, sorry. Jagai. Skipping. Okay. Skill unlocked. Blood for coin. Basically, you get a family discount. So now that that happens, now that we completed that story mission, we can go in here and activate all of that discount right now. I want all of it. That is now a 50% discount on all mercenaries. So now we can go into our army screen and spend the least amount of money possible. Look at that. These guys only cost 3k now. These cost 1.5. These cost less than a thousand so we're buying you he is gonna be one of the guys guarding the um, outposts we're just gonna keep him just hanging loose for now so right now we're gonna go take an outpost and then we're gonna end off the video so let's go ahead and take this one first actually no let's take the one closest to Torvin's place. It's right below us if I believe if I'm correct. I was about to say if I believe. What? Yep, right below us. You would think pulling your chute that damn close to the ground would like have some kind of repercussions. Like even the jolt back should deal some kind of damage to your physical body. Here we go. Rather than an 
Okay, well, say whatever you want, but you're going to end up dead. Oh, I forgot. This is the first one we're doing. Okay, so there's not a lot of captains. It's just him. What's his weakness? Battle weary won't affect him. Fear of Karagoras probably won't affect him. More guy flies. That's not. So you know what? We'll summon my guys right after we stealth attack him. And now this guy is officially dead. Yes. Okay, so they... That's cool. They didn't do that during my first playthrough. They acknowledged the fact that Torvin exists. So they've had run-ins with him before. So if I'm correct, let me test this out. I can like Okay, I'm 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 stealth right now. They don't know where I am. I'm stealth. That is cool. Okay, so don't activate those both at the same time. Shit, enraged by burning. Um fine. Poison bombs then. Goodbye. That was fast as hell. I need y'all over there to chill out shooting me. And whoever's shooting me over there needs to chill out as well. Well, there goes the point. Let's go ahead and grab our guy to defend it. And then I think we have enough coin to buy another legendary, but it'll be the last one. Got it. After you get a, an outpost, you need somebody to guard it. Yes, I get it. I got it. Please leave me alone. You are going to guard this outpost. I hope that was the right guy. I'm pretty sure it is. It is. Okay, good. You know what? We could actually go do one more. I think we've got time, but we need to hurry this up. Because I'm trying to keep all episodes within like 40 to 50 minutes. Just because... I don't even know why. It's just majority of the uh, War for Mordor episodes were 40 to 50 minutes, so I'm trying to keep that as a trend. Who is this? The disease? Yup. Soft-headed? Okay, yeah, he's dead. He's a tank. Won't save him, though. As you've no doubt heard, there's been some trouble in the area recently. Let's hope it finds its way here to entertain us! Oh yeah, that's exactly what I'm here for. Actually. Who is that? Doesn't even matter, I got you. In five, four, three, two, one. Got you, bitch. That was so quiet how that happened. And hit him with the fire. Dead. Damn, he didn't even get to say anything. It just killed him that fast. Alright, I saw a corpse up top. I'm gonna go refresh my bombs real quick and then we can take out what's his name. Or maybe I didn't see a corpse. Okay, I thought I did. Let's call our men. Oh, shit. That scares me every single time it happens. Because it's, like, immediate. This outpost is mine! And you... You're gonna be mine too! I would personally rather not. Okay, these worms didn't quit it. And I forgot I had that freeze thing on. I also forgot I had a flame shield. Okay, hold up. I'm out of bombs. That's fine. We got fire bolts. Everybody get back. Come on, you wanna try your luck? I'm not activating his dying wish. Or whatever it's called. I'll just let my guys kill him. He's pretty much dead. Can y'all just shoot him? Don't make me have to do it. Kill him, please. You're looking at him. You're looking dead at him. He is right... Okay, you know what? I got it. 
Oh, yep, he's got him. There we go. Dead. I feel like he was just waiting for me to commit to it so he could steal, he could steal my kill. I don't know how to feel about that. Alright, we took the bottom half of the map. Never mind, there's still a piece at the bottom. We'll do that all in the next episode. So you know what? Battle reports, hire mercenaries. Let's go do that. Doesn't even matter who it is. The last mercenary on the um, legendary tier list is... Kilik. The unfortunate. Okay, well... And we have enough to hire another legendary, but that's not even possible because there are none left. So we're going to go ahead and end this episode off here. Let me just check what I got real quick. That's a stackable. And what is this? Plus four might when an ally takes that. Nope, never mind. Don't want that either. All right, so we're going to go ahead and end it off here. Appreciate y'all for watching. Leave a like on the video. If you are not already subscribed, go ahead and do that. Turn on post notifications so you know when I drop new videos. And I will see y'all in the next episode.